Hello, Mrs. Williams. My name is Nameless and Faceless, and I am the uncle of a beautiful four-year-old boy who has a bit of cleft lip and cleft palate. I saw the video on that whole thing about your comment on Joaquin Phoenix, and although I do not believe it was malicious, I do believe it was disrespectful. I also know that you gave an apology and made a donation to the uh, Cleft Lip, Cleft Palette Society. However, I've been keeping my eye on Facebook and I've noticed that resentment towards you is gaining traction. Slowly, but surely it is gaining traction. Now, myself, I think that you have done some good things in the past. However, I do believe that cancel culture is a real thing. And on you, it's even though it's slowly gaining traction, it is gaining traction and you do not want to let this fester. Now you're asking, what more can I do? I've already offered an apology and made a donation. However, your apology went unnoticed. It was literally like a blip in time compared to the video that you've done. I'm here to offer you a bit of a suggestion. Here's how you can make it right. You have a platform, you have a show. Invite people on your show who have cleft lip, cleft palate, who have got it fixed. And people who haven't gotten it fixed. Invite family of those people. And who knows, maybe offer a bit of a scholarship to those people. This is a teaching moment for you, for them, and for the world. Because you don't want to let this simmer and fester because it's going to boil over and rot. So to all those people who are angry at Wendy Williams, I, I, I hear you. I see you. I am the uncle of a boy with cleft lip, cleft, lip, cleft palate and... Let's keep our fingers crossed. Hopefully he'll get his surgery soon. But please, 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 Miss Williams, fix this. You really want to fix this.